welcome to the best stories this is the third part of classification of plant we have already learned about the cryptogams in detail if you haven't watched that video the link is in description just click over there and in today's video we will be talking about phenerogams in detail so without wasting a time let's get started Phenerogams is made up of two Greek words, phaneros, which means evident, and gamos, which means marriage. These are also known as spermatophyte. Phenerogams are plants that have special structures for reproduction and generate seeds. In these plants, after the process of reproduction, seeds are formed. that contain the embryo and stored food which is used for initial growth of embryo d- during seed germination also according to if the seeds are enclosed in fruit or not phenerogams are divided into gymnosperm and angiosperm and then gymnosperm further divided into monocot and dicot so let's learn about gymnosperm now The word gymnosperm comes from the Greek word gymnos which means naked and sperma which means seed hence known as naked seeds Gymnosperm are seed producing plants but they produce seeds without fruits They are group of plants which produce seeds that are not contained within an ovary or fruit The seeds are open to the air and are directly fertilized by pollination. Now let's see some characteristic of gymnosperm. They don't produce flowers. Seeds are formed inside fruit. They are naked. They found in colder region where snowfall occurs. They develop needle-like leaves. they are woody forming trees or bushes so the example of gymnosperm is cycas so i think you have cleared idea about gymnosperm now let's talk about angiosperm the word angiosperm comes from the greek word that is angios which means cover and sperma which means seed hence known as cover seed flowers are reproductive organ in angiosperm flowers develop fruit seeds are formed into that fruits so angiosperm are we can say fruit or flower bearing plants the example of angiosperm is all fruit and flower bearing plants now what is monocot and dicot So let's see monocot means the plants whose seeds cannot divided into two equal halves and the plants whose seeds can be divided into two equal halves are called dicot I hope you understood and thanks for watching subscribe to best stories youtube channel and don't forget to press the bell icon for notification of our latest videos